Hey guys, oh, it's focused, yep. So we are going to do the announcement of the official hashtag that I've decided to create to make more awareness and to end stigmas and stay tuned for the end. You'll see how I start this amazing project and hopefully you guys can keep it going. This is my fight song. Take back my life song. Prove I'm all right So I am finally home. As you can see, I did run to a bookstore. Um, it was not my original idea to trying to get my computer to work to do this um, card where you put it in the book. I actually got it from someone on Instagram. Her Instagram is Enjoy the Journey, um, and she had started it. And I love the idea so much that I asked her if I could continue it because she is not right next to us in states and everything um and i also added the new hashtag onto each of these cards so basically what i did and what she has been doing is you make index cards or you can cut pieces of paper and you put quotes on them and for some people they just stick them in whatever books they feel stand out to them um it really depends I stuck them in books that I have read or books that have made an impact. Um, I did a lot of books with mental health and a lot of books about struggles um, because typically when I go to the bookstore, I pick a book that I feel like I can relate to. So although I'm getting out of my world, I'm in someone else's world that's relatable. So I stuck them into pages that I really liked of the books or if I had not read them of pages that seemed to stand out to me um, so typically someone would buy the book and they would get home and they would see that note and even if you don't buy the book if you open it up and look through it and you see that note it just brings a smile to a lot of people's faces and that's really what we need we need to be a team together and to bring awareness and to show each other that we're here for each other so that was my positivity of the day and hopefully we can keep this going you know i'm hoping that this quote that i've attached will be able to keep going so if you guys watch this and you feel like there's something important that you want to put on social media um please add the tag more than assumptions um or do a card we really want to bring this hashtag and make it known because we really are more than assumptions each person is individualized and not everybody understands that in fact a lot of people don't understand that so we all come with differing flaws and things that we're good at and we tend to fall into a subcategory based on our imperfections and that's not fair so if you have something that you feel deserves to be heard, as I'm sure many people do, remember to put it on social media and use the hashtag more than assumptions. Um, no capitalized, no nothing else. No one else has this hashtag yet, so that's why it's so special. Um, so with that happy news, I unfortunately have to go into a quick medical update, as I've been promising everyone, and it's been really difficult. I didn't really want to make this part of the vlog and I've started it for three days and I just never could put it up. So tomorrow is my surgery. We do not have the time yet. Um, there are a lot of risks with this surgery because it is so big. We found out on Monday that it's much bigger than we ever assumed it would be. So my chances of needing a blood transfusion or having some really bad medical happen are a little bit higher than someone that is going into this with less medical. Um, at this point, we are, what well, we have already weighed the pros and the cons, and we've decided that this is the best option. 
regardless of the risks um, because I still have those risks if I do not do the surgery and it's kind of just like a waiting game for that. So we've decided to go through with it. It is happening tomorrow. It is about a six hour surgery. Hopefully I'm going to be in in the morning. We are doing a dual surgeon. So Dr. Vaccaro and Dr. Heller will be performing it. Um, and Dr. Vaccaro does the Eagles and the Phillies and the Flyers, all their surgeries. So I'm pretty confident that they have the, my best interest in hand. Um, I just wanted to put it out there in case something does happen and I am unable to vlog or vlog for a little while that I will be keeping footage. It just may not be posted on YouTube for a little bit. Um, I am not giving up YouTube. I am strong-willed. I am determined to get better and I really just want to make this work. So I just, I hope that it works out in my best interest because I really am here to make a difference and I really do believe in the quote that it takes one person to build an army and an army to make the world better. So, you know, I'm just doing my part in what I feel makes me happy and I really hope that you guys can continue this with me even when I'm unable to do it. So, um, I will be having updates posted on my social media I probably will not be the one posting those updates, but for anyone that's wondering, um, I do appreciate everyone's prayers and love and good well wishes, um, and we just really are hoping for the best, so I really do thank everyone that's continuing to follow me on my journey, and you know, just gotta keep fighting for freedom.